What's going on guys? Normally I wouldn't do a video like this just because I really stopped doing videos like this where I go over updates and stuff like that, but um this is a this this is a big update for Phasmophobia. They holy crap. Uh while my game is updating right now, they they went ahead and man, big update including many major bug fixes and optimizations. Why is this a big deal? Because if you join me on any of my streams, you would have seen a lot of these bugs. Um the I would say the top ones you know what? Let's go over it. This is this is the biggest one right here. Fixes fix the bug where the microphone would reset in the audio options each game. So we we've constantly had this bug on stream where when we're joining a game, sometimes I can't hear everybody, or sometimes one person can't hear us, or whatever the case may be. Like some sometimes the audio just bugs out, and so they went ahead and they fixed this, and I'm glad that they fixed this because it was a big problem on live streaming. Uh, the next one is several optimizations to help with timeout disconnects. This is a good one too because um, if if you again if you watched my live streams, you'd see people dropping out because they would get disconnections from the servers and stuff like that. So that that's a good one too. Um, fix the bug where dead players couldn't use voice chat. So this was a problem because when you're dead, it's just silence. If there's somebody else that's dead, you can see them, but it doesn't work. Sometimes. You're able to hear the other person, but you can't talk back. Sometimes you can talk, they can hear you, but you know it's it's weird. So they fix this too. So now when you're dead, you can talk to each other. Fix the uh, fix the bug where vo where dead players were able to talk through the walkie-talkie. Again, this is another one where uh, you know as a player you're able to talk using the walkie-talkie but not everybody was able to hear you or whatever like it or some or like the live players were able to hear you it's it was weird but they took care of that fix the bug where you take a you could take a photo outside of edgefield and would count as dead body evidence um i didn't have that one but it's interesting fix some spots where you glitch through walls in tanglewood never had that fix some spots on the farmhouse maps where the ghost could get stuck we've had this happen on live stream Actually, it happened last night on stream where we were in the farmhouse, we were in the attic. The ghost got stuck on the stairs in the attic. So I guess the ghosts will be gonna be they're gonna be a little bit more vicious now that they can't get stuck. Uh, fix an issue where you could change the text to style of your name. Haven't seen that. Fix the bug where VR toggle mute was set to hold and not toggle. I don't have VR, so I have no idea. Um, Fix a bug where rebinding drop to the left menu or left mouse button would make the man, main menu unusable. Uh, potential fix for save files being corrupted if you crash. Fix a bug where the ghost wouldn't always lower the room temperature. This is a big one here because we've had this uh, a few times where we couldn't find the last piece of evidence and it was supposed to be freezing temps and the ghost didn't lower the, the temperature. So now it does it properly. Perfect. Okay, here's another one too. Uh, that I've had. I had this last night too. Fix a bug where your sanity would raise during a ghost event. Uh, I had this yesterday. And I, I was confused as to why my sanity raised up to 100%. When before it was clearly below 80. So I'm glad they fixed that. Fix a bug where the ghost death hands could be seen on cameras. <laughs> um, excuse me, I'm yawning. It's, I'm tired. We streamed last night. I just woke up and I only slept for maybe about four hours. So, um, but I haven't seen that. That that would have been funny though. Fix the bug where you can take photos through walls or doors. So now, uh, taking a picture of a ghost when you're outside of like Roadhouse and like the ghost is on the stairs. Yeah, don't work no more. Uh, fix an issue where players with one gigabyte VRAM graphics card would crash in multiplayer when loading into a level. That probably, that probably helps out, uh, helps out laptop users. Ash, I'm calling you out on that. Um, probably helps out laptop users, to be honest. Fix a bug where the photo evidence names would be different languages. Haven't seen that. Fix a bug where your sanity would raise by 25 during one of the ghost events. Interesting. Maybe that could explain my, uh, my sanity ra raising up like that. Uh, fix a bug where the windows and door handles and some doors were still visible when you were dead. Fix a bug where the ghost orb would sometimes get disabled. Ah, so there's another one where we couldn't find the ghost orbs. 
And they were supposed to be there, but now it's fixed. Now ghost orbs would, would show up. Perfect. Fix smoke where smudge stick smoke would last forever if you swapped it into your inventory. Shoot, I didn't know you could do that. Huh. Fix bugs where you could get temperatures through walls when you're outside. Haven't had that. Fix an issue where objects could fall behind the truck shelves and made it unreachable. Haven't had that. Fix a bug where several players' sound effects were not affected by master volume. Fix a bug where you push the talk had to be held down for one second after your question for it to register as a fra phrase. I didn't know that was a problem. Uh, fix a bug where default items daily challenge wouldn't complete. Fix a bug where the thermometer would set off motion sensors. Really? Uh, Ridgeview. That's Roadhouse. Fix a bug where ghost orb would spawn outside of the basement. Ah. Fix a bug where VR players would spawn outside the truck if they were outside of their play space. Ridgeview Roadhouse. Again, fix a bug where ghost orb would spawn outside. Why did they put that twice? I guess, I guess it was that important. Fix a bug where the ghost would try to throw items that were on the VR inventory belt. That's funny. All right, so changes. If your voice recognition is working, you can no longer get a response on the spirit box just by talking. It will now only answer if you ask a question. Well, I guess that's good. Uh, updated localization. Lower the pitch of the EMF reader sound. Lower the brightness of the lights on the main menu. Uh, ghost writing will now count for photo evidence. I mean, it was kind of glitchy on that. Sometimes it counted, sometimes it didn't. Uh, but now, officially, 100% counts. The lobby room will no longer show empty uh, or uh, full rooms. Lower the amount of sanity that you lose during a ghost event. Okay, so now our sanity drops less during ghost events. If your voice recognition stops working, the spirit box will default to giving a random response by talking. Okay, the room temperature will no longer raise over time if the ghosts leave the room. So if you got a, a roaming ghost, that's going to be a little bit harder to find the temperature, I'm guessing. Uh, let's see. The server invite code will now always be hidden by default. Oh, okay. Oh, that's perfect for streamers. Thank you. Okay. They added some stuff. Uh, new. Added a voice sensitivity slider on the audio options. That's, that's good. That's very good. The text on the spirit box will say what the response said. Oh, so if you're looking at it too, got you. That's that's good. I like that. Um, added a copy button to the server invite code. Oh, dude, that's that's perfect. That is perfect. So they added a copy button for the server invite code that can be used when the code is hidden. That is perfect. Thank you. Thank you. They're keeping streamers in mind. I love this. Uh, added text to show the server version on the server password screen. Added a button to enter passwords from your clipboard. Added LIV support for Halloween. Additions for Halloween or added. I'm sorry. Added LIV support for VR. Additions for Halloween. That is perfect. Thank you, dude. Yes, they are on top of stuff. I wonder what they added for Halloween. Oh my god. You know, the one, the biggest thing I want them to add, the biggest thing is for when Michael Jackson is hunting you, for him to walk around going, hee hee. If they can do that, Devs, if you're watching this, if you can do that, oh my god, I would be so happy. It would be so creepy. Just like, you know, Michael Jackson, can you give us a sign? Shamona! Like, yeah, do stuff like that. Hell yes! Hell yes! And, that, and then if you do that, make Michael Jackson pop up a little bit more. And then have like Michael Myers, and then like, if if, uh, <laughs> if he's hunting, you play the Halloween music. Or like, uh, uh, Jason Voorhees, that you, you play the like that type of stuff oh please they should do that they should really really do that uh with that guys thank you so much for watching today happy hunting